Hello again, and welcome to week four of Vlogmas. This week did not have as many clips because I was just kind of enjoying my vacation. I did receive a gift card from my mom, and so I purchased some paper from Pepin. I think that's the brand. Uh, they have these really pretty A5 letter writing paper, and it comes with blank and lined paper, and the back of it is just beautifully illustrated in this botanical theme. I also purchased their sticker, like label sticker pack, and this matches the wrapping paper that I ordered a while back. And it just comes with various sizes of labels and stickers. And it just features this beautiful floral botanical theme. I'm already looking at other themes from this brand because they just have such an array of different styles. And I'm excited to buy some more. I just really love having A5 paper ready, especially beautifully decorated paper that I can use for pen pal letters especially you know it, it actually works really well with fountain pen and it fits perfectly in my typewriter and it just looks so nice and I'm, I'm i just really love having really pretty paper to use for both letter writing and typing i also added another wax seal to my collection i added this t-rex wax seal i love dinosaurs and i have the dinosaur themed postage stamps so i thought this would be a great fit and Mind Speaks has a really pretty dinosaur origami stationery set, so I think this would be just great to use with it. And as I mentioned, this paper actually does really well with fountain pens. I was actually pleasantly surprised with how well. I am always kind of under the impression that most paper doesn't work with fountain pens unless otherwise specified, but no, this one actually did really, really well. So I'm really excited to use this in my pen pal writing. And then of course I'm just excited with how cute the dinosaur came out. And then I practiced Spanish, but I was getting a little frustrated um, this Monday because it was just something wasn't clicking and I was forgetting things I had learned in the previous units and it was just getting, I was getting frustrated. But I am not gonna give up, I'm gonna continue attempting and practicing. I really love this dress. It has the cutest little puff sleeves and I always like wearing it, but this day I didn't really film too much. I waited until the end of the day where I decided to cook frozen salmon with pesto. I'm sorry if it looks weird. It was actually really good. And then of course the cats are always interested in what I'm doing in the kitchen because they think they're gonna get snacks. This is Augie. He's, he's, he's just very food driven. And then, of course, we plated our food. We had penne and some leftover tortellini along with the salmon. Um, and I know it doesn't look like much, but it's, it was actually really, really good. Oh, and some broccoli. I really enjoyed eating it. And then, of course, Wednesday, I barely filmed anything during the day. It wasn't until the evening after work where I finally decided to film um, myself painting my friend's little 3D printed dinosaur we were gonna see each other really quick and he gave each other our gifts and so i wanted to paint this for her and so i did that and then of course i w while i waited for her because she was coming over later i wanted to knit something but i didn't want it to be anything long so i just decided to knit my uh, little mug koozie and then we saw each other we, of course we wore masks and she gave me this ferris wheel press fountain pen ink which i have been really loving the colors in their autumn collection and I really wanted this color and I can't believe she through telepathy knew that I wanted it. The packaging for this brand is just gorgeous. I love how they design their packages and their bottles. This is the 38 milliliter bottle I believe and they do have a larger one but just it's beautiful. I, it's so well done. And then Christmas Eve hit. It was my first day of my vacation. I went to my younger sister's house to pick up a few gifts. She purchased this cute little tote bag from a local Houston artist, Gabby Ramirez, and I love her style. It is so cute. And then my older sister purchased me this really comfortable pea coat from Old Navy. I'm so excited to have an excuse to wear this. And then I just continued knitting this koozie because even though it doesn't take very long, I was 
like I had started it pretty late and I was just finishing it up. It doesn't normally take this long, but I really enjoy knitting and I haven't knitted all year. So I'm glad that I fit in one little project. And then I didn't film the next two days. I was just enjoying my, you know, being home, relaxing with my husband. We read books in bed and then we watched a lot of movies on Christmas. It was just nice to just kind of unplug and enjoy the holiday and we of course zoomed with both of our families it was nice to see their faces even if it was on a screen but i'm just so thankful and happy and i hope you had a great holiday